All right, so welcome back to another episode. Thank God for ass that guy. Now, here's the thing. I have legitimately tried to. One second. Right now it's working. I was just making sure that the controller is working out, guys. So. Yeah. Now, I was trying to make the video on Sayaka, so it crashed while I, while I was trying to make her video, so yeah. So I'm trying again, yeah guys. So yeah. Let's do this shit. I wonder what kind of aisle I'll be when this is all over and I graduate. Graduated. get this out the way like she looks awesome in the bikini like that bikini is actually is actually a reference to that one poster that that she had of her in that exact bikini in Dang Robber 3 so yeah An obvious 10 out of 10 for me when it comes to that when it comes to that bikini that Saika has in that artwork Cutscene. Well, I think I died and gone to heaven. Um, what is it, Tadamichi? Well, uh, sorry for staring. Hey, it, it kind of, it just kind of struck me. I'm standing right next to the famous idol wearing a swimsuit. Whoa! I didn't mean to sound like a creep. I meant it more like an admiration or something. Probably that special. Besides, everyone is wearing a swimsuit right now. Well, that makes it even crazier. We got an idol, a fashionista, and even a real life princess. Uh, it just feels so extravagant. But everyone comes to you to fix bro broken down machines. Huh? Me, I mean, I do what I can. What about. But, though, you see, an environment where an alternate mechanic can fix whatever you need is pretty extravagant to me. <laughs> then there's Kurumi, who makes tea. Kurumi always lay us sam sample new many items. So, <sighs> so we can listen to Kaede's piano at lunch. Everything is our daily lives is extravagant. <sighs> Damn, you may be. All an extravagant. But plus, I'm featured in plenty of swimsuit magazines and calendars. It's hardly anything special. Hey, hey! Can't say I mind. That's pretty. That's still plenty special in my eyes. All right. Oh, 
aren't about that guy. Alright. That's what's up, bro. Move car, I'm using that. I'm using that shit. Alright. Beat his ass. Let's go. Sorry. To keep in you wing. It took longer than expected to get ready. <laughs> nah, girl, no bigs. We're still waiting on a couple of stragglers anyway. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Oh. What's got into you now, Makoto? And Raptor on the fire side of Saiga, are you? No. <laughs> I'm I mean, probably, yeah, yes, probably. Why? No need to squirm. Anyone will be head over heels for an international sensation in her bikini. Hey! Go on, tell her what you think. She's dying from your anticipation. Hey! Oh, for the bike. Shut up, man. You're only making it harder for the poor boy. Hey! A psycho. Hi, Makoto. Have you seen what they serving at the beach hut? I wasn't expecting it to be so extravagant. <laughs> Why don't we go go try out the shave ice while we're waiting for everyone else to show up? Yeah. Good idea. I'm in. <laughs> Man, I haven't swam like that in ages. And Kaito and Himiko buried in the sand. That's hilarious. Sorry! I want to leave to go play without unbury you. <sighs> it's fine. Okay, let's go back. I'm starving after all the running around. Okay! Come on, Makoto, we should head back too. <laughs> I can't remember the last time I've got to play a beach like this. I had a lot of fun. Yeah! Me too. Hey! Uh, Saika. I clearly missed my chance before, but... Um... That swimsuit is lovely on you. Thank you so much. Uh, um. I always get paraded around in their swimsuits all the time, so I was afraid you might not care. Oh, no of course way. not. No. I mean, I care about more. I, I care about more than the swimsuit, of course, but it does look great too. <laughs> I'm glad to hear it. All right. All right, man. Bye. All right. What? Oh, Saika, out for early run. <laughs> Come on, hide me. Exercise is a habit of mine. I'm jittery all day if I skip it. Yeah. I always seem. To seem like they have limitless energy, but I'm sure that's a result of a ton of effort. Okay. When it comes to building your body, it's slow and steady with emphasis on the steady. But I guess I empathize to the slow part too. But yes, all idols work hard to stay fit. No. Slow or not, I'm impressed. Exercising is kind of like indirect effort. Or sign. Uh, um. In the rack. 
Yeah. I'm sure you need to be in shape for all those intense performances. But for instance, um, martial, a martial artist works out to get stronger. A musician practices singing or instrument. You're right. But this feels a bit different to me. Um. Uh, I kind of get what you mean. Hey, um. Basically, that working out isn't something I necessarily need to do. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Yet, here you are, working hard. You must really love being an idol. <laughs> I certainly do. I can't say that much with confidence. But... It's just that you can't just do what you lo love and not no else. Does that make sense? Huh? Uh, maybe. You see. There are very few people who do what they enjoy. For a living and never run into trouble. Um. From frustrating incidents to fights with co workers and just plain jobs from hell. But. None of these examples are uncommon. And yet, I never think about quitting my auto career. <laughs> oh, I must have signed so full myself. Hey. Not at all. You're really something, Saika. Yeah. I'm glad we, I'm glad we talked. I'm sorry for hogging up so much of your valuable time, though. <laughs> it's fine. I rarely get to talk to anyone about this kind of stuff. I'm glad we talked to. Okay. Anyway, see you at breakfast. Um. Doing what you love, huh? All right. What is it? Rise oh my God, bro! Oh yeah. my God! Them still so in the ring. And both of y'all can go fuck yourselves in, the, in this game. Alright, let's go. Alright. Hell yeah, bruh. That's what the fuck I'm talking about. Hi. Yeah, bro. Alright, he's still paying the card, okay? Okie doke, so long. Farewell. Alright, yeah, guys, so uh, yeah. Okay, uh. So, let's go. Six move card. Alright, so four times, times two equals eight. Okay. Right, let's go. Damn it, I don't have enough, bruh. All I can do is potential for your town, okay? Um, All I can do is potential. I could go global or I could experiment with new styles. I have lots of really simple ideas like that, but I don't think that's what they mean. I, My potential, the path I choose, the future as an idol. I think of which one to do. Uh, 
What about this? What about the lifelong career one? Hey, um... Kodoko, are you ever going to return to the entertainment industry? Help! Not a chance. I'm going back to be a normal girl. <sighs> That's a shame. But I guess it's true that not everyone who finds themselves with success actually wants it. And not everyone who wants success will be able to find it. Or keep it if they do. Seriously? I, for one, can't understand why anyone would want to be in the industry if best with filthy adults. <laughs> I'm sure by now you, you've come to understand how, just how much responsibility it is to be adorable. You are as adorbs as they come. The more time you spend around those ugly adults, the sooner you will, find, you will want to rid the world of them. Note that Kodigo has went through a lot of shit in the entertainment industry. So yeah. Um. You're right that this isn't an industry where you can survive on nothing but dreams and ideals. I... But that doesn't invalidate the beauty of the dreams I was show me as a child. I want to be a part of the world of that world forever. Yeah, bro. Alright, so... I'm part of the world forever. It would be one thing if only weirdos like you who enjoyed the hell got suckered into it. But well, none of that matters anymore. I'm going to play with Monka. I reflected on some things you need to survive as an idol, desire, good look, and determination. Alright. Five. Let's go. One. Let's go to cutscene. Hey, um. Good morning, you two. It's not a nice day. Aww. Good morning. Thanks for bringing me. No. Yeah, tomorrow. Try acting a little more huh? normal. Oh, I did. I did again. In front of Saika. I'm sorry. I can't help it. But. Psycho will never feel at ease around you if you always that awkward. Hmm. I know, uh... You just don't understand how I feel, Makoto. <laughs> you two really get along. I always wanted an older brother. So I'm a little jealous. Hi, Makoto! And your brother mode is so delightful, Makoto. You really are different around your sister. <laughs> Give me a break, Psycho. That's really embarrassing. Um... So you really are Saika's classmate, huh, Makoto? Yeah, bro. That's... I told you so. But... See it with my own eyes to be classmates? Jeez! It takes a while to process something as wild as that. Why don't you understand? Saika, I'm really sorry about this. My little sister is always such a pain. <laughs> no worries. I can tell she admires me. And the support of my fans is priceless to me. Amazing! What a wonderful thing to say. She is a genuine idol, Mikko. <sighs> Trust me, I know. Let's calm down, okay? Alright. Out. 
Damn it. I got my ass whooped by this dude. By the dragon, bro. Dude. Right. Three. Okay. Go. Hell yeah, bro. Take his ass down. Sick. Hell yeah, bro. Take his ass down too, bro. All right. Go. So. Go to another cutscene. Let's go, bro. Let's go. <sighs> Alright. Yes. Swimming is a beautiful ocean and soaking in a heavily hot spring. Is, this is good. <laughs> Isn't it? I'm worried about what will happen once I return to the real world. If I get used to this. What? Oh, is this a cooler? Huh? You're right. Did someone forget? It would seem... No, it has Kaido's name on it, along with a note that says, take whatever you want. <sighs> and inside is, there's drinks and bite-sized ice cream. <gasps> Cold juice, and ice cream, and a hot springs. Sign me up. <sighs> Snacking in a bath and salt. But, I must admit, it takes, it just takes better like this. Anyway. The note is in Kaito's handwriting. So it's unlikely that it's someone prank. <laughs> so it it should be safe to eat. Okay. Oh yes, yes, I will I haven't gone to the beach hut today. So I serve this. Okay. I will have some too. What about you, Kyoko? It's true. Well I suppose the occasional Sweet, can't hurt. Alright. Let's go. Ah, ah. Took your ass down, bro. Give me back the money in the game, bro.
spin it a bit. Okay. There's a festive underway. Where you, you can try things sound related to time. I've been working in the kitchen in the restaurant. Some people are out, but they need it. I'm totally free, but some of the other staff seem to have yeah, trouble. Can I help? Let's see the tank on. You have a run with customers. How dare you! I cannot believe I allow myself to waste your time over some damn dessert mail. Uh, um. So you have a dispute with some customers. I know I should be spreading you know, Kyo instead of engaging in cat fights. <laughs> Fortunately, they were the classmates, so I'm sure we can come to am amicable resolution. I cheer her as she beat a big grungily apologize. Shot card. Let's see how it goes. What? Damn it. You bastard. Hey! When you're soaking in the bath, you get melodies playing in your head. Um. For me, it's my favorite classical music, pop tunes, and even music that doesn't even exist yet. Yes! Hell yeah, I do. Sometimes I even come up with entire songs in the bath. Uh. Wow, really? I. Uh, unlike you two, I can't come compose music in my head alone. Uh. But new songs I, pra I practice do get stuck in my head. Sometimes I can't help but sing along. <laughs> A lot of torrents by Saika in the highest bath venue around. Hell yeah, sign me up. <sighs> Baths really do work wonders. Even if you're exhausted. It clears your head so quickly. Oh! Yeah, and sometimes it just gets you amped. <laughs> In fact, I'm feeling amped right now. The noise just ain't stopping. <laughs> I'm not gonna do all that humming thing. And then I come in with a guitar like, no! <laughs> <laughs> oh, I like that. If only I had a piano here. I improvise and play along. <laughs> Sorry. That's a that was a bunch of silly nonsense. Sorry for interrupting your bookie. No problem! No, no. That was a sick move. Oh, 
dum dee dum And then, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Come on. Sing along to Kaite. Huh? Me too. Uh, okay. Alright. <laughs> and a dude to the road to the, yeah, baby. Thank you very much. <sighs> How lovely. <laughs> singing isn't my forte, so it's kind of embarrassing. But singing every once in a while is pretty fun. Alright, I, I actually like that cutscene. You get to see the musician all in one scene, basically. Two, Farewell and fuck you. I'm getting rid of this stupid Dominic card. There's two cards I want to get rid of, bro. Okay. All right. Ew, okay. That's what fucking fun was for. Four, four, okay. Good shit. No cutscene. Hey, um. It's been a while, cut it off. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> you were on the variety show together once. Mama! Of course I remember you. There isn't a girl who doesn't know about you. But then again. But I don't know about any variety show. That's all in the past. Sorry. Past. I didn't mean to bring up something you rather forget. <sighs> I retired months ago. It's all a lifetime ago. <laughs> that doesn't stop people from calling me a little ultimate drama and dragging me here, here though. So, so you retired from all that shit. And thank god you retired, bruh. Because if you played Ultra Bear Goes, you'll know what happens. Seriously? Not for Monica being with me, I would have I would have fancy objected. Um when I was your age, seven months really did feel like a lifetime. But as you get older, time starts to fly by and blink a lot. Okay. Maybe that's why those around you have so much trouble keeping up with your life. Aww. Yeah, well, it's really annoying. I'm an old girl now, damn it. You know, a girl must be what makes you happy, huh? Yes. I never even wanted to be famous. Anyway. You're in the industry, so I'm sure you understand. Okay. That's true. For me, it was a long thought after dream that I was finally able to grasp. But... Unless, with that said, I don't blame you at all. And I respect your decision. <laughs> as long as you can smile, You've made it the best choice. Alright. I... I just realized something. Huh? It's, what's... Is it, it all of time? You see! Maki, you really... You have a really nice style. What? Is that seriously all? 
Oh, did I surprise you? I've always admired you. So I couldn't keep that it. You're slender with long limbs, but have a nicely toned physique thanks to your sex size. Sorry. Just there. Weirdo. I'm not even a rival idol, but you sure are looking at me like I am one. Um. I'm, I'm thinking about feminine charm pretty much every single day. I always try to refine my vision of the ideal idol, but, mm. but uh, being an entertainer must be tough. <laughs> oh, you, Maki. Do you have a, a vision of what you considered the idol most wonderful girl? So what? Not really. I see. Actually, maybe I do, although it's not an idol. I honestly forgot that you can't look back at the dialogue. Ah. Oh, what kind of girl is it? So what? Ordinary. Someone who isn't glittery and flashy like you. A lonely, primary, but gentle and kind. That kind of girl sounds wonderful to me. Um. Are you describing a friend of yours? That's true. Something like that. You see. Someone to share memories with and cherish. I wouldn't stand a chance against someone like that. Huh? But that's why. And I don't want glitter and shine, but she has to share a smile with everyone around her. Okay. Even if I were the top idol in the world, I could never take that person's spot in mine. Hmm. I suppose that's true. She's still very much a part of me. You see? I can't be any one person's number one. Which is why I can smile for people I don't even know. <laughs> but that's the kind of idol I admire. And that's why I'm fine being that way. That's true. You had fans back in my or orphanage. Huh? Okay. They imitated the songs and dances. They weren't great at, of course, but they always have fun. And no, and this is this is actually one of the rare times that Maki actually smiles, bro. You rarely see her smile, bro. Like dead ass. That's good. I'm glad that I could, that my smile could cheer up others out there. That's the kind of uh, I strive to be. Four. Is it bonfire? Yup, bonfire. Mm. So this is the end. Why don't I make some memories of all myself? Let's sing my first song. My heart's contact. Alright. Ah. Thank you for the backing, Ibuki. It's a lot easier to sing along to an instrument. Yes! You can rely on me for whatever you need tonight. Yeah, my guitar. Hey, hey! That song just now? That was a popular idol song when we were kids. Huh? Is it memorable for you? <laughs> yes, it, it's what inspired me to become an idol. I see. I, I knew see. it. You can't be an idol without admiring idols, after all. <laughs> I betcha that plenty of little tights, boots, singing, well, your songs will become idols themselves. Okay. That's true. I couldn't be happier. I sang lots of songs I love.
What's that? Right, yeah. Oh, you're going to want to Another cutscene. Um. Just like Shiro said, it looks like this place has been taken over by as a children's secret base. By the way, we hardly ever come here after all. It's the ideal hideout for those adult hating kids. Hey, come oh, on! Man, what a mess. I know this ain't reality, but do they have to be such slobs? Mm. Children cannot live off junk food, junk food and juice. We need Teratero's nutrition guidance back. Um, it's fun to make secret bases as a kid, I can understand that. Mm. It's a unique and fun atmosphere too, so it's probably more comfortable for them than the hotel. Mm. But when staying in such a dim place be bad for their eyes, would one even be able to rest here? Whatever the case, it can't be healthy. That's true. But, can we really just take their hideout from them? Uh, um. It That doesn't feel right, no. Even us entertaining, er, entering our announce might be enough to upset them. Mm. Should we have a need? At minimum, they need to clean up their mess and spend less time here. Okay. We can let them play here. But I think we need to establish some rules. I see! Then we are in agreement, Saika. Always the voice of reason. Hey! Then should we just leave for now and come back another time? <clears throat> I'm unsatisfied with leaving at mass. But! If you touch their belongings, you might hurt their self-esteem. Huh? They need to deal with it themselves. Otherwise, they'll never learn to clean up, right? Count on it! Precisely. Then sight. Let us withdraw without touching anything. <sighs> It's it another star day where it comes. Where I have to worry about looking after the fucking kids, but <laughs> looking after them. I'm, I'm a little surprised myself, but I feel like we can't just leave those kids be. You don't mind me saying so, but you have a really pretty skin tattoo. Um, I, ne I never quite seen fair skin as unique and lovely before. I see. Really now? As far as skin goes, I think you're far more deserving of that description. <laughs> Thank you for your compliment, but you're the subject right now. Hey, um... Tell me, what's your secret? Well... Nothing in particular. I'm often active at night and early morning, which may explain my paleness. <sighs> so it's your lifestyle, huh? But wow, if you, if you stay up <sighs> so late, that makes it all the more amazing. <sighs> That's almost unfair. Are you sure you're not doing anything special? Hey. Uh, Saika, personal space, what's going on really? Um, oh, sorry. You're easy to talk to, so I guess I got a little too comfortable. What? Me, easy to talk to. <laughs> you're actually remind me a, a little of a leader of my idol group. You see. She's the one first to the left whenever we're on TV. Do you know what I mean? What I mean? apologize. Sorry. I'm not really familiar with any of the members except for you. Yes. But if so I find it impossible to believe that someone in your group would be similar to me at all. But you really are similar. She's the most adult like, the most cool, the most reliable. <laughs> that describes you pretty well, right? However I'm hardly someone to be relied upon. If I must prioritize something over my friends, I will. Okay. See the humility it makes you seem more reliable. You see! Park is cheap, right? But you do what what needs doing without talking up anything. Um... I really 
need to, to make up for it to depend on others all this time. Yes. Forget about me. You should rely on your idol friend. If she is similar, I know she'd be happy. That. Okay. All right. Hey, um, uh, for Kyo, those books you recommend were a big help. Thanks so much. You see, I'm delighted to hear that. Some of the books were quite high level. I'm curious as to your thoughts. Um, they made me realize just how little I know, but that aside, I learned a whole lot. <sighs> curious that an idol such as you were taking interest in the origins of classical theater. Let's see. Might this be for an upcoming work? Sorry. I can't talk about it quite yet. But, but since I may have to consult you for more advice further down the road, but that's why you'll be the first one to hear about it once I can. <laughs> then I shall look forward to that day. Beautiful. I admire your attitude towards your work side, though. Practically pursuing studies in unknown fields. I do it's truly a dream job, but now th and then, people look down on it as bad <laughs> I'm just an idol, but I want to put some real substance to my performance. Excellent. I show before you all the more. That's good. If you're interested, you should listen to my new single that comes out last month. That came I out last see, month. yes. Indeed. Exposure to modern day idol worship would surely be a great benefit to me. Yes, and I am certain my sister would take a liking to you as well. Side, please stop talking about your sister, bro. Please don't. <laughs> I hope so. If you're interested, why don't you listen to it together with your sister? want most right now is to stand on stage and show my fans what I become. Hell yeah, bro. That's what fuck I'm talking about. Because development is complete.
Oh yeah, bro. That'll be it for today's video, guys. I'll see you guys next time. Fire Nation TV. Sign off.